Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Shadows, Shadows Awakening. Awakening. With me, Demonox. When we last left off, we got popsicle We got turned to a popsicle. But now we brought the Sebekan out, and we looked at her, their thing, and noticed that he's having the fire shield. But that absorb damage, resist fires. Ah, so your Sebekan Ice Shield, which is Storm Shield, which is level 2, gives us resist Ice 65. And freeze immunity to near. Wow, you get level, level three. You can, you literally can make him immune to ice. Okay, this makes the Sebekan here very good for this thing, which makes me wonder if the Wood Elemental has something we can use to. So you're off for now. Let's swap you in his place. See, some of these guys have their portraits like just cover the character portraits up. We can't get you, which is sad. Not available in this playthrough anymore. Wood Elemental. Yes. Okay, yeah, I've got to sort out the points for them. That's fine. Because... I have to do that anyway with everybody to begin with. Shall we use a Uh, yeah, you're, you're using either Deathbringer or this. You know what? Deathbringer, because it sounds cool. I don't use you often. You're also a tree. Not sure how you're a tree. Warriors fleeing the thing, but you're a. According to this, you're a mage. I can't have this. It says locked, but let me have it. Hmm. Fasil. Yeah. One of the rings that increased my um There might also be f hold on, there might also be a way to increase Dragon's Beast, Demons Stone Rings, not helping. Yeah, Science means yeah, you don't you can't increase your thing, it has to be um uh, armor. Even that only gives you thing against certain creatures and not elemental. Okay, good to know. Uh, let's see. Bark skin. Okay. What's your cat your poison resistance like? Seventeen percent. How would have I been higher to your tree? Or am I just barking up the wrong tree? Yes, yes, I went for that joke. You can't have helmets, so no point you. You have to get you get another point. And mana. Well, that's actually not a bad. Skill to have for someone who's a mage. Uh, you got blight, vines, bark skin, which gives me uh, 60, but your armor increases quite nicely. Oops, why not? Healing tree, and you'll be level 16 to get that upgraded. Well, that's how the vines improved. Nature's lullaby. Okay, so the wood, so the tree guy does not have the highest poison resistance. That still seems to belong to the ironclad zombie. But well, it was worth a shot. Unfortunately, I can't take Evia out, but. We are now outfitted, I think, with resistances. Ow. Do not mean stabbed, but resistances to fire and ice. You guys find me out here. Oh, 
away from your protective dome. Wow, the fire guys came out to play. You guys should fight each other. You elements don't like each other. I'd like to come running out of the fire zone to fight me. See, they at least have a thing where it's like, you know, you can dodge it because of triggers. A bone demon! I am just all powerful, mate. You guys just hover out here, please, so I can just kill you all. Because you guys do not resist lightning. This my punch, my fists. So, it's a beckon. Beckon can grant high resiliency to. No one else has to come out and play. Let's kill you all out here so it's so easy for me to fight. Fire you that matter. Are you equipped anyway? I did a stuff of fire. I don't have any more staffs though. You have on your hand picked away a load of things. So yay. You got a ton of points to spend. You got a ton of points to spend. I should watch I cannot have nothing to spend it on. That's fine! We have beaten up a lot of dudes, and we have got ourselves a lot of things. The Sebekan, I think, is the choice... ...one of choice for going in here. She has the highest... I don't know if it's she or not, but... They have the highest ice resistance in the group, and the lowest health right now. <laughs> so... Uh, let's see, your skill... Lasts for 12 seconds. We're going to save because I don't want to keep having to do all this. Yeah, we run out of save slots. But if we can. Okay, so. Highest out on that. Wow, she's actually getting positive. Looking out. I grant you the mercy of the grave. Well, we put the sigil in, and that in, and it did that. Well done, Sebeki. I did note that she was actually healing inside there. Pathetic! I shall handle this myself. Yep. So, how much of... So her Sebek... Sebekan... Ice resistance 59, light resistance 54. But she gained, I think she gained that much from this. Resistance from this. Resistance of ice, resistance of lightning. I think they gained, she gained so much it actually went into positive. So instead of damaging, it heals. 
That is my theorem. And I'm more than happy to test it out with her. She can do lightning sigil. And we're saving before we go and do this. I'm gonna save for each one of these because I don't want to having to redo them all. I don't so don't want to have to keep constantly retyping the name in. Knowing me at some point I will mess it up. Next second. That's where we wanna go, so tally ho! Okay, not quite enough. Okay, so that's two of those down. Area here has the highest amount of fire resistance of the group. It's at 46, so she should fire shield ults me by another 40, so that's yeah, that's enough for the meteor, but that's fine. saving because we've done ice, we've done fire, we've done lightning. I'm not sure what actually happens in the next one so we've got poison and we've got because of all my characters I think he has the highest resiliency to poison. Who knows, maybe the bug had more resistance. Have a hardened skull. Let me just have a hardened skull, because you haven't actually had anything for a while. You got the because of the mask, you're fine. You're not fast, Ow. but he is resilient. As I stand there and taking damage for some reason. He died, but we got in there, we pulled the lever. Oh, I thought it was about to run heavier through there to Of course we don't have like a anti anti poison shield. It's a relief. Hey. Right, before I go anywhere else, I'm getting my guys back. Yay! We pulled two we put two sigils in. Four sigils in there. We have no longer got them in that inventory. Better that we I just oh you did all this to get to a door. Will be, but I don't like the idea of that. Okay, put swap Bazaar back in. You're telling me I have a rogue? Bazaar hits so damn often, so quick, it's ridiculous. I mean, it should technically have go wizard, rogue, warrior, and there should always be at least one rogue in your party. Also, he had a. That's 
it's a little low, three level points down, but it's way high on the thing. Uh, you have a new weapon. Heart Seeker, Artifact Bow. Level 6, but this is level 13. I'll assume we have a necklace now. Don't get uppity with me. It's not my fault I haven't given you this stuff for a long time, okay? I just haven't used a rogue in a long time. Like at all. Hence why you have 40 points available to you. points for you. And you have a load of... Yeah, you have a load of stuff. Demon and Hunter. Uh, your best attribute being a hunter is your agility. Regeneration because that's always useful. Yeah, we haven't like used you in like forever. <coughs> Does a lot of damage if you do them correctly. And a good chance I'm probably going to um, go back to not using him again. Because I, no offense to the guy, but I really like the ones I've got. I mean, Evia and Zar are just too useful. Void barrier. Transform, slow down enemy projectiles. So essentially, when they try doing bullet hell on you, you just die by the way. I know it's probably the use. Oops! I don't think. Oh dear. Texture is not. Someone didn't go right. Me now. I should have the two rogue a rogue in my party, but I find iron golems, the iron zombie, ironclad zombies, way too useful for its own good. He's just way too good for his own good. I can't help but use him. Well, we scheduled everything, we pulled the lever on all of them. So, yeah, this is gonna be the run down here now. I don't know what's down here, but we're going for it. Right, let's go blast something. Who dare sacrifice my servants may face me, the Sun Queen. Thou shalt know despair. I went for it, I said. Oh, do I have to summon a sigil out and then bring him in there and kill him? Seems strange that I would have a... Follow me! Follow me! Follow me! 
I'm gonna need a second back out then. Only one who can survive getting across the full lever. about dying instantly. You following? He is following. Good. Come on, follow me. I'm gonna dare sacrifice your servants in here. The beckon is the only one I know who can actually get across the ice flow without just plain dying instantly. Everyone else who tries it gets slaughtered. Evia has massive fire resistance so she can walk straight through the fire field. One, five, two, swap out for him. Actually, no, I'll swap you out for him because um, Zar can hit really hard, really fast. And what we're going to next requires Zbeckin and her lightning shield, her storm shield. Because she's the only one who can get across doing this thing. Me. Come with me, and you'll see to a world where I blow you to pieces. Must I do everything oh. yes. myself? <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. No, we have. Then again, we have a beckon for the getting storms. Run! Run, 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 run. Come follow me, Storm Boy. This is, good. This is where you need your multiple pets. If I had never picked up Sebe the Sebekan, I would never be able to get through that door. That thing. I have sacrificed all your servants. So the mystery of Kogar. Um, it is a slight. You know what? Slightly long episode. We're gonna have. We will shoot. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Hammer of the tribes. A little fifty item. I bet it can only be used by the wood element. Yep. One elemental. He has a massive hammer. I only have three. <sighs> well, when we come back, folks, we shall be back in. You know what? I will fast track. I will fast track us to uh, Duratia. I'll run back there on my own, out off screen. We'll fast track back. Might do a bit of inventory sorting on the way. But we shall get there and we shall at some point find the fourth and final sud sigil. And then I have to go through that annoying teleport puzzle again. Whee. You know, if I remember the time, remember the time that she had fire shield, I would have just used it during the fire elemental split. But anyway, that's all for next time. So until then, folks, until then, I'll catch you all later. See ya!